Hey guys! Today I will show you how to get the most out of Abstract Paint FX. This powerful plugin for Adobe Photoshop creates several artistic effects that you can combine together. Once it has finished processing the image we can go ahead and customize the result. I will start hiding the color adjustments and the textures for the moment so we can clearly see what we're doing. We're going back to those later. Most people will just save one of these pre-made results which is completely fine. But let me show you how to combine two or more different styles in the same picture to have really cool and realistic effect. First of all choose one layer that you like and surely want to be visible in your composition. We make a layer mask and start painting using one of the many high resolution artistic brushes provided. If we invert the layer mask with Ctrl I, this is what happens. White shows the image, black hides it and reveals the layer below. Let's open the history panel and save this version, so we can go back to it later. This is very useful and will make a snapshot of the situation, like a save point. Let's make another version using other layers and then save it in the history panel. It may look complex, but it's very simple. Paint in black what you want to hide and in white what you want to be visible. Now we combine the version 25 above with the version 6 below. These are the versions we have made in a few seconds. I'll quickly make another one. Please like the video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. We can add some textures and adjust colors. Now I'll show you another technique that is more precise. Go to select. Color range. Choose highlights. We'll select the highlights using the color range, and not by painting manually as we did before. The mask now matches the highlights of the image, and reveals what's below. Here let's see it better with a black layer behind everything. Now we can choose the version for the shadows. These are all realistic, well painted and different. I totally recommend you this plugin. Let's see how easily you can install it. Click on the .ccx icon and in the Creative Cloud application. Click OK and follow through. Go in Photoshop and find the plugin under the plugin menu. It's very important to click on this gear icon and choose, as tools, when asked. Done. Enjoy this plugin that will work forever in your Adobe Photoshop. Thanks for watching guys. I really appreciate your support. Even if you don't buy anything please click a like or give me a follow it really helps and support my work. Many thanks. Love you guys.